You know what's interesting? I was messing around with this TV and I found a very interesting feature on this TV. Before I had this feature on and I turned it off, I was having this light across the screen, like a vertical light, just in the middle of the dark areas, like the dark scenes, like this light, vertical light. You see where I'm pointing this... Uh, V mode, I call it the V mode, it's an LG mode, I call it V mode, like this light would peak across the screen vertically, up and down, up and down, this annoying light during a very dark scenes. And guess what I did? You know, I fixed this problem. Let me show you. This is how I fixed this problem. Let me just put this over here like this, and uh, I'll show you in a minute. This is how I fix this issue and this problem. Uh, this issue, it's not existent anymore. All you have to do is go to the settings. Here, let me show you. Go to this, you see right now this, this bleeding light. I don't see it anymore. It's more natural. This is, this is for people who have this TV. I've fixed this problem now. It's called local dimming. That dimming light, you want to turn it off. I'm going to show you where to turn off the uh, dimming light off. And I also want to show you some other tricks that I have found out on this TV that can help you. All right. To give you that best quality picture. All right. So go over here. Like, like, let me move my camera over here. Hold on. So make sure you go over here to a uh, picture settings. Go to the game settings right here. Scroll all the way down. Go all the way down. Go to the picture options. When you go to the picture options, all of these filters, turn them off. Turn the noise reduction off. Turn the noise reduction off. Turn the MPEG noise reduction off. Turn the black level to low. This, leave it off. Local dimming, make sure you turn that off. Turn the local dimming off, man. You want to turn that crap off. That's how you fix that issue. And now the, the deep blacks look much better, man, on the screen. There's none of that annoying light that shows up vertically anymore. Turn that dimming all the way off. Also turn the true motion off as well. And there's another trick here to have those deep black levels. Let me show you. Go to advanced control. Turn the dynamic contrast totally off. Dynamic color, you can keep it high. That's fine. Uh, preferred color, leave that alone. Color gamut, leave it at, y, at wide. You can leave it at wide. Super resolution, keep it at high to get that pro, uh, that sharpness. And then gamma, here's the trick. Once you turn off your local dimming off, make sure you get your gamma to high. Keep your gamma at high, one. Keep it at high, one. And those uh, deep black levels will be even more blacker and deeper. And the second trick here is your brightness man you want to keep that brightness to 35 keep your sharpness at 12 your color is 65 and your temperature is C10 and you know what we're gonna do right now we're gonna uh, boot up a uncharted 4 just to see how well it works now under those conditions in the dark okay let's do that remember guys the trick here is to turn off that local dimming off Turn that sucker off. And look what happens. There. You won't have any of that annoying crap anymore. That's on there. Turn that local dimming off.
you see you don't see that uh, annoying vertical light that's there anymore you see that light would usually show up if I had that dimming all the way to the high but that vertical light here let me show you what I mean let's let's go back I want to show you something really quick here's what happens when you have the local dimming to high here's what happens let me show you advanced control here's what happens look what happens put that on high and look what happens you guys can see it but I see it that local dimming everything gets lit up very bright on this corner like there's this annoying vertical light that shows up so you want to make sure you turn that off so make sure you turn that sucker off and this is how you turn that off just go right here to a picture mode settings now you can use a different type of uh, I use the one that's called bright I keep it like on there but make sure you go to the uh, picture options and turn that sucker off dude turn that shit off there now it's much better dude turn that off go up there off local dimming it's off so remember you want to make sure that local dimming it's off turn that sucker off dude and you'll see a much more better quality here everything looks more natural see like the the deep black brights they're not bleeding like they used to be bleeding because you got that dimming off that light dimming crap off so it's gonna look much better now especially here and that's what you want All right all right I mean it just looks better honestly it just looks much much better now what the heck am I supposed to do here hold on a second am I supposed to go in there again am I supposed to come underneath oh I see there's one last one down there let's pick it up let's bring it up All right, so I got the box. We got it in. Let's put it back here where it belongs. There you go. I mean, honestly, it looks much, much better now when you turn the local dimming off. Also, make sure you leave your brightness at uh, 35. You see, I already helped you guys. See, even with this TV, I'm able to help you get the best possible quality and fix some of these issues. That's why I do this channel, man to help everyone not just one brand but various different brands here we go and we're ready for liftoff man that's it we're good to go brother come on let's go it looks great man it looks great here we go nice you see it looks more natural and colorful right here and you guys can thank me later I just helped you get that annoying annoying bleeding bright and annoying light that pops up on the uh, dark scenes in the game so there you have it guys I fixed the problem turn that local dimming off man turn that shit off all right guys have a good one and happy holidays merry christmas happy new year